Hello YouTube, it is Waker on Collapse, and today is my 1,000 subscriber special. I'm really, really excited about this. Thank you very much to everybody that has made this happen, and I really, really appreciate each and every one of you. Even if you're not subscribed, I still appreciate you. That's just the kind of guy I am. I'm actually shooting this a little bit in advance. I have about 920 subscribers at the time of shooting this video, but because of a couple of single card purchases that I'm making, this seems like a perfect time to do this 1,000 subscriber special. Now you may notice that Umbreon is in the background, and that means I'm going to open something, and believe it or not, despite the fact that I have already had my farewell party, today I'm going to be opening a booster box. And that booster box is the second expansion of the Diamond and Pearl series, Japanese Secret of the Lakes. Really, really awesome. I've never had the chance to get my hands on this box. It is the last box that I need to help complete my fourth generation set. I actually didn't open a box of uh, either of Diamond and Pearl 1. I ended up completing that out of packs, well, working on completing that out of packs. Quick look at the box art. It's really awesome. I finally found it for a good price, and I just had to pull the trigger and uh, start working on the set. Now, it is a very big set. Uh, this set has about 130 cards in it, which is just enormous. Between that and Shining Darkness, there are like 250 cards between the two of them. It's crazy. Um, this set, I believe, was part of, um, I make tons of noise, as for the usual. I believe came from the English Mysterious Treasures, or led, I guess, to the English Mysterious Treasures set. So you'll see a lot of cards that, uh, are shared between the two sets. So you can see, uh, one was a lot of inspiration for the other. Now, being that this is a fourth gen box, if you're familiar with how I tend to do things, we're going to be opening this in two parts. So we're going to do ten packs per part. And to be honest, I don't know really anything about this set, except I did a quick look up of the trainers. So we're going to dive right in. I think it's going to be one rare and one hollow in each pack. So we're going to see if I can get the card trick right. Yeah, believe it or not, it's been a while since I've opened stuff, so I might be a little bit rusty. But time to put a big dent in this set, and here we go. Again, we're guessing. I don't know if this is going to be right. All right, uh, let me adjust the light a little bit here. I'm gonna bump it up, make it nice and bright for you guys. And I think that's gonna be as good as it'll get. All right, Magikarp, Bronzor, Zubat, uh, Sfeel, yep, Cyndaquil, Quick Ball, uh, Vigoroth, I think. Yeah, that's the second one. Is a Vigoroth. And I can't really tell, is that a Graveler? Yeah, I guess it's a Graveler, that's cool. Like I said, not familiar with the set. And Water Energy. Uh, my rare is, good, I did the card trick right, is uh, an Ariados. That's nice. And my Hollow, awesome. Which one is this? This is uh, Yuxi, right? Yeah, I think this is Yuxi, very nice. As you can see, the, uh, the, the hard part of not opening stuff for a long while and then coming back and opening stuff is you're rusty on your Pokemon names. But I'm pretty sure this is Uxie, so this is a great hollow to start off with. Kind of sort things out a little bit, make it a little bit neater. And nice. Alright guys, next pack. We have Apon, Murkrow, uh, Nidoran, whichever one, male or female, I don't remember. Uh, Vulpix, Spinarak. Uh, this is Team Galactic's Wager. I think this is the one where you play rock, paper, scissors, which is weird. Uh, Croconaw, looking badass. Love that card. And a uh, Bayleaf. And another Water Energy. Uh, rare is going to be a Mr. Mime. That's nice. And my Hollow is a Feraligator Hollow. Very cool. Looks kind of goofy in comparison to how awesome the crocodile looks, but it's still very nice. So, uh, yeah, we're just going to keep on rolling here. Got um, eight more packs to go in this part, so we'll see how it goes. We have Teddy Ursa, Sfeel, Remoraid, uh, which one is this? Uh, Snover, yeah. Uh, Spinarak, uh, Darkness Energy, this is the uncommon one as opposed to the regular. Uh, Haffany, and Kranidos, followed by a Metal Energy. Uh, my rare is going to be a Wall Rain, awesome, very cool. And my Hollow is a Luminion Hollow. 
And I opened a box uh, during the uh, farewell party that I had, and I think it had aluminium in it, and I was really blown away by the artwork, and this is no different. Really great job of showcasing the Pokemon in this, so that is awesome. Very pleased to see that. Let's keep the good times rolling and keep just ripping through these packs, you know, proverbially speaking. Alright, we have another Teddy Ursa. Uh, Larvitar. It's a cool uh, view on Larvitar, actually. Get another look at that. Uh, Zubat. Vulpix. Chikorita. Uh, fossil Excavation or something like that. Uh, Dugong, awesome. And uh, Masquerade with a Darkness Energy behind it. Uh, my rare is going to be Unknown. Is that I? Yeah, it looks like Unknown I, so that's cool. And my Hollow is a Beast. Tyranitar. Love it. Now there's lots of Tyranitar fans out there. Uh, Salons vs. Tyranitar for one. Uh, Jordan Japan Pokemon 2 for another. So uh, shout out to you guys. Lovely card. Hoping to pull an extra one of those. Maybe I can have it up for trade for anyone that's interested. Now because I uh, said that I was doing a big purchase, uh, if I don't pull a certain card out of this box, that doesn't mean that I'm looking for it. Make sure to check my wants and haves list if you have something that you want to trade me from this set. Uh, Larvitar. Uh, Manectric. Yeah, oh no, that's Electric. Sorry, it's Electric. Uh, Finion. Seal. Paris. Uh, Dusk Ball. Uh, Girafferig. And a, what the hell are you called? Why am I locking up on this, uh... Oh, it's Shield On. Yeah, because Bastiodon is the big one, I think. So I think this is Shield On. Uh, and another Darkness Energy. My rare is an Ursa Ring. Very cool. Awesome. And my Hollow is an Alakazam. Nice. Done a great job of avoiding duplicates so far. Hoping to keep that as long as we can. Of course, being a big set, it's a bit to be expected. So we're halfway through this 1,000 subscriber special part one, I suppose. Really wanted to save this for something good, so I hope you guys are enjoying it. Uh, we have a Slackoth, which looks just odd. Uh, Zubat, Finion, Remoraid, Surskit, Octillery, Magby, and another Masquerade. And the energy is a Fire Energy. Uh, my rare is a Glalie. Big fan of Glalie, so that is awesome to get this. And my hollow is the Bastiodon. Very nice. That's presuming, of course, that I didn't switch them up, which is certainly possible. But sweet. I did not check to see how many hollows are in this set, so. Can get as many as we can. Next pack, got a Murkrow. Uh, what is this? Barboach? Is this Barboach? Yeah, I think it's Barboach. Um, Armor Fossil. Yeah, I think this, yeah, Armor Fossil, Vulpix, Paris, Night Maintenance, I believe, uh, Laron, and a Sand Slash. Awesome, so that means Sand Shrew is also in the set. And another Water Energy, crazy. Uh, my Rare is a duplicate, that's an Ariados. And my Hollow is a duplicate, but it's an awesome one. No surprise, it's another Tyranitar. So that one's going to be up for sale or trade for anybody that wants it. Just let me know if you want to purchase it. I uh, wholeheartedly accept PayPal. Cash by mail is okay too, but PayPal is vastly preferred. So. Keeping it going. This one I think is the Skull Fossil, if I got the colors right in my head. Uh, Electrike. Uh, Buizel. Barboach. Surskit. Uh, Pichu. Hello. Everybody wave back, come on. Yeah, that's what I thought. Uh, another Croconaw, and a Tropius. And a Lightning Energy, which I didn't have yet. Uh, rare is another Walrein, so that's a duplicate. And awesome! My Hollow is a Lucario Level X. Beautiful card. Uh, the other Level Xs in this set are Magnemite and Electivire, and I already have the... Not Magnemite, Mag, Magmortar. They're not similar at all. And I already have the Magmortar, so I was hoping to get one of these two. So it is awesome to get the uh, Lucario level X. Now, if you're familiar with my Platinum series openings, you'll notice that the uh, the holographic effect on this card is a little bit lackluster in comparison. But it's beautiful artwork on the card, and that's something that uh, no amount of sparkle can make up for. So, really, really awesome job they did with this. So, 
Nice. Lucario level X. A sweet pull. And hopefully not the final sweet pull of this uh of this part. Because we got two more packs to go. Alright, we have a Chansey, nice. Uh, Abra, Shinx, Totodile, a lot of new ones so far there. Uh, Armor Fossil, Night Maintenance, Happiny, Dodrio, and a Fire Energy. Uh, my rare is another Unknown Eye. Can never be too sure until you look at the card. And nice, the Hollow is a Mesprit. That's awesome, great companion piece to the Uxie I already pulled, hoping to get the Azelf later on. Very sweet. So given the size of the uh, of the set, I'm very pleased so far with my pulls. Hoping to minimize the damage of all the stuff that I've got to buy, so. Last pack for this part, guys. Another Teddy Ursa to kick it off. Aeron, Geodude, uh, Cricketot, Paris, Bebe Search. Hello, Knockoff Misty, how are you today? Uh, Darkness Energy, and another Tropius. And another regular Darkness Energy. Uh, my rare is an awesome one. It's a Gyarados. Coming out of the water, it makes it look like it's just one big giant head with a little bit of neck still attached, but still looks super menacing. And my hollow is another Luminion, so while it is a duplicate, I'm happy to get it. Nice. Quick recap of the polls for you guys. We'll set these back, and I'll be uploading part two probably tomorrow. I don't see any reason to upload them both the uh, same day, but... We'll see what I decide once a thousand subscribers really rolls around. Luminion, Mesprit, Lucario Level X, probably the prize of the of the uh, of the video. Uh, Titar, Bastiodon, Alakazam, another Titar, another Luminion, Feraligator, and a Uxie. Thanks a lot for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure you subscribe to see more openings in the future. Maybe, possibly, could that be a hint to something? And uh, stay tuned for part two because it promises to be epic as well.